What's up guys, Andrew Cooks Art here. Today I'm going to show you how to use Photoshop to make some custom thumbnails for YouTube videos. Okay, so I'm just doing very simple. These don't have to be perfect. Um, but the main tool that I'm going to be using today is um, the transform uh, tool. Okay, so I've got a couple images of caulking. Looks pretty good. Okay, so I'm going to drag these with my v my arrow tool and i'm just going to grab the image bring it up to this tab here and drop it down do the same thing with this image take it bring it over and drop it okay and you see here let's turn off <coughs> let's turn off that layer first okay so this is going to be luke skywalker's gun caulking gun okay so first thing i want to do you notice it's white all right, so I want to get rid of this white. And to do that, you know, simple way to do that is with the magic wand tool. Okay, so grab that. Have the tolerance pretty low because I don't want this white tip to get uh, get selected. That looks all right. Maybe it's a little too, too low. Let's go to 20. And, and hit it again. Okay, that looks good cleaner. If you need to like clean up, um, you can go with your quick selection tool and you can subtract. Go and clean up just the tip. It doesn't have to be perfect again. Um, this is going to be a very small image. All right, that looks pretty good. Okay, so now this er uh, this is selected. So I want to inverse the selection by going to select inverse and then I'm going to add a mask. There we go. Got my mask. All right, now look how big and weird this is, and it doesn't look quite right. Okay, so what I'm going to do is click on my image, not my mask. I'm going to hit Command T, okay? And I can rotate the caulking gun. I can change the size of the caulking gun by hitting shift and keep keeping that shape. And another thing, notice how it doesn't look right. It looks like it's pointed off. I want to point it at me. Okay? I want to scare the viewers of this photo with, you know, this terrible weapon of destruction. Alright, so f to do that, I'm going to... Um, hold command. See, hover over this little point here, hit command, and you see how it turns into an arrow. You can like bring that guy over. <clears throat> Let's see. Any, anyway, uh, another thing, like if you're wanting to navigate around, you can hit spacebar and your cursor will turn into a hand and you can navigate easier. All right, let's bring this guy up. Bring this guy over by, oh, looking scary now. Looking pretty scary. Okay, let off that. And it's pointed a lot better now, I think. Okay, just holding that command button. <clears throat> that command button is pretty good. If you get used to this. So let's see, look how it's transformed. That's the transform option in Photoshop. All right, let's go up here. Just let's see what see what this looks like if I bring this down. I think that's a little too direct. All right, I still want it to look like a caulking gun because it is a joke, okay? Double click your gun and then you will have. Okay, that's wonderful. All right, I see this white here. Click on your mask, use your brush tool. If you need to, uh, if you don't understand how to use masks, I made another uh, video called Dragons Are Real. Okay, watch it. Look at how to use your mask tool. 
Uh, I'm gonna make this just a little bigger. Okay. Okay, and set that. Good. Okay, save. I'm saving this YouTube Star Wars PSD. Good. Replace that. Because I already did this and I didn't record. Alright. Next, go to this guy. Same process. Same process as before. Oh, wait, 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 wait. Before we select this, hit, hit, um, Command D, deselect. Let's transform this right away so it's smaller. Otherwise, it'll not select everything. Okay. That's good. Okay, now I can use my select tool. Perfect. Go to select inverse and add your mask. Perfect. V. Okay, and command T to transform it. I'm just going to rotate this around. Looks good. Make it a little smaller. Okay, good. Perfect. Okay, Han Solo has his caulking gun. Now, Princess Leia, we need... She can't be defenseless. Okay, so let's go to our layer. Go to duplicate layer. Okay, and now we've got a copy of this. Okay, since I'm showing you how to use transform tool to do all this stuff, I'm going to hit transform. This is something else you can do. Just you now there's other ways of doing this. To copy it and reverse it. But for today's purposes, okay. Looks pretty good. Okay, that looks nice. Double click to set it. And I'm gonna bring my Luke Skywalker's caulking gun all the way to the top. Okay, look at the white box around Princess Leia and Han Solo's caulking gun. All right, so let's just click on our masks, go with the brush tool, <clears throat> clean this up. Okay. There's a little bit on that layer too. Okay, and Han Solo's. We don't want a box around on Solo's caulking gun. Okay, so now they've got their caulking guns. That looks good. Okay, so the last thing that I want to do, I want to save. Always save. You're going to crash sometime in your life. And I'm going to grab my text, and I'll say caulking gun, caulking mold. Select all, and I want this just centered up. And we'll put this right there in the center. Uh, let's bring this up to the front. And you can double click if you want to change some of the sizes of this. I'm gonna make this smaller. That looks pretty good. There, you got a simple simple way of making your um, your thumbnails for your YouTube using the transform and the transform tool and some layers okay so I'm gonna save this file save as a JPEG format JPEG and there you have it let's replace that one this one looks good all right people have fun, be creative, start using transforming some stuff, and then make something, okay? You're getting more skills. So, Andrew Cooksart signing out. Please uh, share this, like it. If you, you know, have a better way of working, leave a comment below. Um, and maybe tell me what you want to see. Do you want to see any, any demos? Um, in Photoshop, please ask me below. Okay, we'll see you guys later.